We begin tonight with a house fire that has left four families without a home and a firefighter injured. Let's go to our Randy Gyllenhaal who joins us live from Summit. Randy, what have you learned out there? Yeah, Natalie, a whole lot of people having to find a new place to live. Just take a look at the damage here in the southwest suburbs in Summit, uh, the attic as well as the roof of this three story building and part of that roof collapsing as well. So everybody in here had to run out as smoke and fire filled the upstairs. About 17 residents evacuating this afternoon. Summit firefighters also on scene, knocking those flames down inside and also making sure the four families got out safe. But one firefighter was injured, a shoulder injury. Just take into the hospital as a precaution. Nobody else was hurt. The owner of this building, which was an apartment building, tells me the flames began up in the attic. Unclear why, but there is pretty significant damage. The building dates back about 100 years. At this point, the cause of the fire unknown. An investigation is continuing here. We have seen the Red Cross on scene helping some of those displaced residents, but because of this damage, all 17 are not going to be able to go inside and will likely have to find a new place to live. For now, we're live here in Summit. I'm Randy Chillin' Hall, NBC 5 News.